The most affected districts in eastern region include Butaleja, Namutumba, Sironko, Bukedeya, Bolambuli, Katakuya and Kumi. In western Uganda, Kasese, Rubirizi, Luwanda, Kabarole are the most affected. In central region, the districts of Nakasongola, Chiboga, Mubende, Mitiana and Impiji are also affected. In northern Uganda, the districts of Otuke, Aleptonga are also affected. Kasese in a sub-county called Mahango, a flood washed school going children and killed two. Uh, in Mahango, in Kasese, it is in our radar. Uh, Fort Portal, there is a whole village that suffered a storm. It is in our radar. The rains that have destroyed crops have now left millions of people at the risk of starvation and in urgent need of relief. Those crops cannot afford to stand in stagnant water even for two, three days. All the tubers are rotting away. In July, the Uganda Meteorological Department predicted above normal rains in several parts of the country and warned of possible devastating effects. Minister Echweru says the service delivery in these districts is also affected as several roads have been washed away. To the extent that as we talk, the Minister of Education has a huge responsibility to cause candidates in some of those areas to do exams, even if there are no roads. So they must be helped to reach the schools. In the 2019-2020 financial year budget, government allocated close to 50 billion shillings to the contingency fund. It's this money that the Disaster Preparedness Ministry hopes to use to extend relief to these affected areas. Habadziwa, NTV.